Um, you guys, I have to... I'm going to start this again. Today, I am hosting my first blood drive after my cancer journey. Um, if you followed me since 2020, you know my story of being diagnosed with acute myeloid leukemia. And if you followed me closely, you know how many blood transfusions, platelet transfusions I had during my treatments. And if you followed me really closely, you know how many people prayed, danced, supported me, but also donated blood for me in honor of me. And you know how much blood saved my you cannot put a price on life. The best gift of all that I get to live today, that I feel as I'm in my blood drive right now and I'm talking to the people and I'm seeing people come in. One, they're taking the time. They don't have to. They don't have to do this, but they are because they love people. They want to help. So to see women and men come in and want to give up their time, first of all. Second, donate their blood. And they're donating like these bags, right? And to me, I just, I remember sitting in that hospital room getting bags of blood and my nurses would just come in and be like, oh, you need a transfusion. Oh, you need platelets. Oh, you're low on red blood cells. And there were times I couldn't even get blood because my blood type was so different. It was different and I had to wait sometimes a day or hours. I couldn't just receive blood because there was a lack of blood donation in my blood type. And so that, for me being where I'm at today in my journey, I have to make this a part of my healing and my life today is to be able to encourage everybody, but also to let you know how thankful I am, how grateful I am. I hope you guys know how freaking grateful I am for my life. And I hope you guys know that like I was telling one of the people in there, the donors in there like, I just, I feel like I can never do enough. Like I'll never, I'll never be able to do enough for everything that you guys did for me. Everyone that's donated blood, everybody that's done everything for me to be here today. So I'm just, oh my gosh, I'm just so grateful. But also watching people give up their time and their blood today and their hearts are so good. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And with that, like if you are healthy enough, if you are able, please sign up somewhere to donate and donate regularly. So people, not just cancer patients like me, but trauma victims, anybody that needs a blood transfusion, we can give them that life, that gift of life. Um, but I love you and I hope you know how grateful I am.